Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we got a really dope video for you guys. So before we get started, I'm going to announce that I'm actually going to be leaving Twitch along with OG and we're going to be joining DLive. Now I'm going to be dropping my DLive link in the description below. It's also going to be on screen for you guys. So there's a bunch of YouTubers that you guys already know, such as like Coach Corey who stream on DLive. So myself and OG are going to be joining him there. We're going to be streaming there. So if you guys can follow the link that I dropped below, it will mean a lot, obviously, you know, just dropping a follow coming by every now and then it would mean the world. So anyways, please, if you guys can follow me on DLive, come check out a stream or two and see if you guys like it. And with that being said, today we have our first challenge video in a very long time. So somebody recommended in the comment section a couple videos ago that we should go, the, we should play a comp and then whatever comp we face, we should try and go that comp and beat. So now I have a little bit of a twist to it. So that, in my opinion, would be would be a little bit easy for myself. So what I decided is we're going to be playing some duo showdown with Ali. And instead of going the comp that we face, we're going to be using the fifth place comp in every single game in the next game. So we're just going to start off with Carl and Mortis. Not really a great comp, but decent comp. But as we go on, whatever comp comes last, we're going to use. Now, these are very high stakes games because as you guys can see through my brawlers, I have a lot of very high brawlers this season as well as Ali who just hit 30k has a ton of high brawlers as well. So this can be very high stakes and get really bad and really messy. So with that being said, let's hop into the games and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the first game. So we're going to spawn beside two boxes over here. So obviously a pretty epic start. I'm uh, just going to get these two really quickly. Now, I'm going to try and go towards another box just because I'm a Mort and I can get there a little bit faster. So, I see there's a Jesse and a Crow team fighting over here. So, maybe we can pick off something over here. We're just going to go in, whatever. Okay, we're going to die. Not the greatest start. So, I don't know what happens if we are the fifth place team. I didn't really strategize for that. Um, hopefully, we don't end up coming fifth. Um... Ali's just going to try and do some Ali things. She's going to use her gadget right there. Not really the best use of a gadget, but who am I to say anything? As I kind of just went in and died for no reason. So honestly, I might try the same strategy here. Okay, so I think I'm going to die again. Um, Yes, I am going to die again. And I believe so is Ali. Yikes. So a bunch of teams just got eliminated. Okay, so we got fourth. Okay, so that was kind of bad. I was like, uh, we just got fifth the first game, but no, we came fourth. Not that bad. So, I mean, pretty bad. Minus seven. So we're going to go into the next game and let's see what the fifth place comp was. Okay, so looking at what we have over here, we have M's and Crow is going to be the fifth place comp. Now, I don't know about Ali, but my M's is 900. I believe Ali's might be 900 or if not 1,000. So let's see what we have and we're going to go M's and Crow in the next game. Okay, so here we go into the next game. So Ali does have a 900 Crow and M's and my Crow is only 700 while my M's is 900. So just for the sake of being nice to Bobby BS and maybe not losing as many trophies, I'm going to be going Crow for this game. So we're going off to a pretty good start over here. So we're going to try and not come last or second last this game i feel like that would be pretty epic so we're gonna be moving into the grass over here gonna get one shot off on that crow crow's gadget is really unbelievably good uh definitely one of the strongest gadgets in the game so i kind of just outplayed myself i think by moving forward so we didn't just come last so that's pretty good no last place for the homies this game so we're gonna just take position over here um mr p porter is obviously really good in duo showdown i've gone over that recently in a semi-recent video so there should be a crow somewhere over here just chilling three teams left we know where they all are so that's pretty good and i still have all three gadgets um i do have to try and get my jump which could be a little bit difficult since all these teams are pretty ranged but we're gonna see what we can do so we're like the middle team over here oh this team's trying to team oh no we won't team we are against teaming so let's see what we can do here. These guys have an alliance and I don't think they're very willing to break it. So I think we're just going to go over here. Try and get use of this heal. But this is kind of toxic. We're getting 2v1 over here. Not very nice by our opponents to do this to us. We are kind of close to our super. So if we can get our super and we can try and potentially jump on someone with our gadget. That would be pretty good. So we're pretty close. Okay, we have it. So I'm going to try and fully heal here. Okay, I'm definitely not going to be able to fully heal. So I'm going to go for a jump. I'm going to be able to get a kill. But I'm going to go down. And this is not looking very good for Ali. And we're going to come third. So this is just unfair. That was 
not cool at all by the other team. Unfortunately, no gains, but also no losses, so that's not bad. Let's move into the next game. Guys, please don't team. It's very toxic. Okay, so looking over here, it looks like the fifth place comp was double crow, and we literally can't go double crow if we wanted to. So what we're going to be doing... Was that Ben Tim teaming? Was that Ben Tim teaming? Mr. Ben Tim. Oh no, Ben, Mr. Ben Tim. That's not very good. But anyways, <laughs> we can't go double crow. So what we're going to be doing is going crow and Brock. So let's hop into the next game and let's see what we can do. Okay, so here we go into the next game. Now, before I continue, I just want to say there's a lot of people named Ben Tim. There's definitely more than one. So we don't know if that is the Ben Tim. Um, so just for sake, let's just say it's not the real Ben Tim. Um, I don't know. If he's playing duo showdown or whatever if he teams but that's none of my business um probably isn't him so let's just move on over here so we're gonna be going with the crow brock comp um let's see what we can do over here so we're gonna just try and get our super because obviously super mixed with gadget is a really good combination so crow and brock is pretty cool i would ideally like to play brock but again my crow is only 700 trophies so it's kind of epic that i can only that i can play a 700 trophy brawler and it will work out for the challenge so again try not to come fifth um, Ali's trying to get some tabs. I'm just out here trying to get my super. I feel like if I get hit by one spike RNG, I would die. So I'm going to just back up. Trying to get my super. I'm like one shot away. So I don't think we're coming fifth. A tendency that I like that I'm seeing right now is that there are a lot of crows. I just saw a crow die. So something that wouldn't be OP <laughs> when playing a crow is being on a Pam. That's exactly what's happening right now. So Ali's going to go in for a super. If she gets a hit, I think I'll go for the spike. Okay, so I did go for the spike. Unfortunately, though, really good Pam gadget over there. So we're not the last place team. So that's pretty epic. Gonna put a shield up. Oh, I'm still gonna go down. Oh, that's not good. Allie's pretty, pretty much stuck over there. She does have her jump gadget, so maybe she can make a play. But I think she's kind of waiting until we respawn, which is kind of a pro play over there. Four, three, two. Oh, she makes the pro play, and I'm gonna go to... Oh my god, she jumps over. Okay, she almost made god tier play. So, so far fourth place i'm gonna just jump for no reason nothing's gonna happen oh we're gonna come fourth so again not the greatest we could do another minus seven we are not doing very well on this video so let's go into the next game let's see what the fifth place team is and let's get into it okay so going over here it looks like again we're gonna be playing brock and crow so let's get into the next game Let's get this dub. I know we're, we are going to win this game. I know for an 100% facts. Let's get into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go into the next game. So again, I promised we are coming first this game. There's no way we're not. So pretty decent spawn right off the start. We got two boxes above us and I believe two below us. Oh, never mind. Someone's getting that box. So let's just get this one and move up over here. Hopefully there's no team that's going to jump me. I'm going to wait a little bit. Going to shoot that box. Going to start shooting the next one um pretty good start we're gonna have five power ups so we're a pretty strong team over here looks like ali might be shooting oh nope she's not shooting at anybody so i'm gonna just try and get my super so i feel like crow jump with the gadget is gonna be godly when we have five. Oh, is this an afk oh that's a free kill for this crow gonna use my gadget oh i didn't use the gadget no okay gonna activate it and run away so it's kind of a waste of a gadget over there i thought i activated it so i probably would have gotten the kill if i did but i did hit a, or get a misclick but that's fine so we're going to go down here because we see a weak opponent. Oh, there's a Leon over here. Going to be able to get that kill. Good kill over there by Ali. So we're going to go back into this bush. Remember, I guarantee it a first place. And it's looking pretty good so far. Pretty good so far. There's a bow over there. We have pretty good position. A good spot over there by Ali. She's playing really good right now. Going to be able to hit that crow. Oh, pull over here by this team. Oh, that's a strong team. Definitely don't want to get too close to this. Going to heal up over here. Although I did acquire my super, so that's obviously really good. Allie's going to use her super. She's going to be able to kill the bow. So really good right here. Three teams left. So we're already in a pretty decent spot. We have eight power ups, so things are looking pretty decent. Looks like there's beef going on down here. Going to try and involve myself a little bit. There's a really weak Leon, but I don't think we're going to focus that team. I think we're going to just focus the stronger team over here. Crow's going to be able to take that out. Gene's going to be... I think he's going to go down. He is. I'm going to use my gadget. Jump on this Crow. It's going to be a really... Oh! Oh! I meant Crow. I, it was a Leon, but that's not even the point. Because the Leon 
It was a gadget. I'm going to be able to take out that crow, and this should be game. And there we go. I promised first place, and we were able to get it. So really good. Again, we are climbing back. We're only minus five now, so not terrible. Let's hop into the next game. This one is going to be a guaranteed win as well, like I said last game. So let's hop into it. Let's see what comp we have to go. We have to go Rico and Pam. Pretty interesting. Let's hop into the next game, and let's see what we can do. Did I say Rico and Pam? I don't know. Okay, so here we go. I don't know if I said Rico Pam, but we we're supposed to go Rico Rosa anyway, so not a bad spawn. I guess I'll go to the top here. So again, I have Gadget, and Gadget might be really good on this map because I can connect a lot of walls. Now, Rico, I'm not sure, but let's see if Ali can ball out on Rico. We don't know what's going to happen. So again, a pretty decent spawn. We got three right now. Looks like there's a Mr. P going up against Ali. Ali's going to go down. I'm going to pick this up and also pick up her. So I'm going to have six. So I'm going to be a pretty strong Rosa. I'm going to put grass down just over here so I can kind of try and hide a little bit. Pretty good juking at the moment. I'm going to try running up on this crow. Not going to be able to, but we're able to survive. Ali's going to come back and we're just going to chill out over here. So unfortunately, we did have to kind of like waste one of our gadgets, but we are chilling. I do have six, which is pretty strong. It makes me a pretty big Rosa. So let's see what we can do. I'm going to try and run up on this crow. No success. In fact, we're probably going to go down here. Crow uses gadget. It's going to take us out. Now we might come fifth here. Ali might get pinched. I'm a little bit worried right now. Let's hop into the next game. This one is going to be a guaranteed win as well. Very strong Mr. P and a very strong Mr. P in showdown is one of the scariest sights that you can see. Pretty good juking right now by Ali. She's going to be able to stay up long enough for us to survive. Now there's a very weak team over here. So hopefully we can get this team. I think this gene made a little bit of a misplay. So we're able to get a kill over there. We're going to move up. Crows, or not crows, sorry. Brock's going to use some jump. And now we're just chilling over here. So I'm going to add an extra bush for myself to hide in. Not going to be the greatest use of a bush. And I'm probably going to go down here. Not great value. Ali's going to use a super. And that's going to be a third place. So my guaranteed win did not turn out as a win. But a third place isn't the worst thing in the world. So we're going to go into one final game. Let's see if we can come second or first next game. So we can go positive in trophies. Let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so right now we have to go Crow and Rico. So Ali's going to stay on the Rico. And I'm going to go Crow. And we're looking for a first or second. So we can get back into the positives for this video. So with that being said, let's hop into the game. And let's hope for that dub. Okay, so here we go on our last game over here in a pretty decent spawn. Um, I don't like our comp at all, to be honest, but I do like playing Crow in Showdown. Okay, so there's a Pam coming towards us already. I'm just going to walk right to this Pam and say, no, you're not allowed to take our box. We're going to move down over here. A team with three, so we're kind of getting pinched. Not purposely pinched. Team isn't teaming or anything, but, you know, we're just kind of stuck in between two teams here. And these two players, or these two brawlers both do counter Crow, so this is kind of toxic i'm gonna pop my uh super or my gadget sorry just trying to charge my super gonna be able to do a decent job at it gonna try and hit that 8-bit going to be able to gonna try and hit the pam again again going to be able to so we're pretty close to my super over here which is really good they are pretty set up which is kind of unfortunate because they're a very strong team when set up ali's gonna whiff her super i'm gonna try and hit the 8-bit power thing the boost I don't even know what it's called. We're not going to be able to. Going to try and take out... Oh, this is not very good. Going to jump right into the 8-bit. Going to try and stay alive. We are going to be able to and almost charge our next super. So that's a pretty good jump over there. We actually are in a fairly good position considering what we're going up against. But it looks like they are going to put up their double turrets now. So Ali is kind of on the run. I'm going to make a jump for this Pam. Going to be able to get that kill, but that's going to be my final gadget use. So that's going to be a little bit toxic. So right now, four teams left. Ali with a little bit of a miss super there. Oh, that ape, it's going to go down. Spike, spike. Please, Ali, help with the spike. Uh, okay, I think I got it. I think I got that spike. So spike's going to go down. Oh, that's a strong, scary looking ape. So we are not going to mess with that ape. I guess we got to hope for second place at this point. So another strong team up here. They just activated their speed, so they're probably going to be aggressive over here. I'm going to try and hit that max. So the max is going to go down, so pretty good. Oh, there's a Pam right here. Should be a free kill. Going to be able to do so. I don't want to jump on that spike, because all we really need is a top two to go positive. And there we go. Ali's going to be able to pick up a kill. So I'm going to go for the big boy play, and I think I'm going to jump on their 8-bit. I'm, uh, I'm not sure. I'm kind of scared. Gonna take some shots, gonna go for the jump, and I'm gonna land pretty much directly on the 8-bit, and that is going to give us a first place, maybe? Yes, 
Okay, there we go. We got our first place. That's going to be a plus nine, and we're going to go positive on the video. So that's a dub right there. Let's go. And we're going to be, <laughs> and we're going to be what? I think plus four after six games. So it's not that bad. That's almost one trophy per game. So a pretty solid outcome. But anyways, that's going to be it. I hope you guys enjoyed this challenge. And if you guys did, let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see this type of challenge again or a different challenge you can always recommend. If I like them, I'm definitely going to do them. So anyways, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. If not, you know, let me know what you guys want to see. But anyways, it's going to be it for me today. I will catch you guys again tomorrow. Peace.